he had the right call. I just thought some cars would stay out, and we'd end up losing two uh, cars that stayed out, but, um, you know, didn't, just lost in the restart. What did you see between Hamlin and Busher? Was that, or not him, uh, Kyle Larson and Busher? Was that all clean? And was it- yeah, I couldn't see. I mean, I had a few cars blocking me. I had my own hands full there, uh, but it looked like a great battle um, there on that final lap and certainly uh, you know paid off the fans that you know came out and uh, stayed the whole night I mean you, did you feel like you were in control of the race there at the end and what, what happened on that restart well, I think there's any dispute that we were the fastest car for sure but um, I mean I, I thought we were going to finish 20th uh, at with 70 to go uh, but you know just damn it I, I really wanted to get another one there um, and, you know, had we not had that caution, it, it was going to happen. But, you know, it's just uh, didn't work out. You know, it's just one of those races where uh, we, we got one on a restart at, um, at Richmond and lost one here. So it all works out. Was there any contact with you and Larson on that final restart? Or? No. No, there wasn't. Um, he uh, just made the right move to split me there. Uh, it's such a tough spot. I probably definitely should have stayed um, on the outside knowing that, you know, I thought maybe he was going to choose the outside, but I it just he made the right call for sure. And um, I just was in a spot where once I got stuck three wide, um, I had no momentum, and you know I just got free trained by everybody. Do you think Truex was going to get you? Were you, were you, you know, going so slow on fuel there at the end? That if it had gone green, was he going to? Was he coming fast enough to get you? Not that I, I not that I was aware of. I, I was saving so much that I could have gone probably a second faster at the end of the race if I needed to. So I, I'm certainly in control, for sure. This is Austin Dillon, driver of the Bass Pro Shop Chevrolet. Make sure to hit that subscribe button. Also check out one of those two videos beside me. Visit frontstretch.com for more racing content.